Good afternoon. We are at 2002 Hamilton Crossing in Cantonment, Florida. This home is listed at $186,900. It's 1,953 square foot. It's a three bedroom, two bath. It was built in 1996. So let's go inside and take a look. You notice one thing, we've got an architectural shingle with a hip roof, which makes for really good entrance. You can see that the home has gutters all the way around the house. See these nice little skylights on each side of the door as we enter in? So once we enter in, we're in a foyer that has tile flooring. You can see it's all vaulted and open in the great room. We have recessed lighting and ceiling fan. Immediately to our right in this open area that's all vaulted, you can see the formal dining room and this really nice wood laminate flooring. We have a really nice bump up bar. See all the plant ledges and nooks in the home. And we do have a wood burning fireplace. But what I wanna show you immediately when we come in, one of the first things that we have is an office that's right here, right at the front of the house. This is an office bonus room, has this glass door. There is no closet in this room. It does have a ceiling fan. And this is being currently being used as an office. Also has this wood flooring on it as well with this glass door. So again, here's our formal dining room. You can see the chair rail, the light, the lighted areas up at the top. So as we come in, I'm just gonna pan you right around this living room. We've got this nook here for the TV area. We've got this really nice slider. You can see this really nice slider that goes out to that screened in porch. Screened in porch is really nice size. It's seven by about 26 or 30. That looks right into the master. Just pan you right back around of this living room. So if we look here, we have a really nice breakfast nook with this tile flooring. We have really nice wood cabinets. This is a total electric home. We do have a built-in microwave. You can see some of these glass cabinets. Cooktop that is electric. You can see the long pantry over there. And again, this tile extends right in. We've got dishwasher, garbage disposal, and you can see all the cabinets in the kitchen and that overlooks that living room or that great room for entertainment area. And then you're right here by your formal dining room. Kind of looks you here, let's go. Take a look at the master bedroom. You can see that door that leads out of the master that leads to that screened in porch. We do have carpet in all the bedrooms. So this is our master bedroom with tray ceiling and ceiling fans. So this is a really nice size, a lot of light that comes in. And again, in this master, here's that door that goes out to the screened in porch. And we do have some nice size furniture, so you can see there's plenty of room in this master. If we go in this master bath, this master bath has all wood cabinets as well with this marble top, double vanity. You can see this really nice, it's almost like a pantry that's built in in this bathroom. You can see we do have a separate shower and we do have a jetted tub. We do have a private water closet. We have some light that comes in. This just gives you a shot of that double vanity. And then right in here, we have the master closet. So really nice walk-in closet here. So this is our master. So if we go back out, you can see this recessed lighting that's in the corners of the ceiling in this master bedroom. So if we go back out, we're gonna go all the way back across. This is just a shot to pan you back this way. We're gonna go all the way back across to the additional two bedrooms that's on the opposite side of the home. This is a split floor plan. You can see right here we have a linen closet. This is one of our additional bedrooms. Ceiling fan, and again, this bedroom as well has a door that goes out to that screened in porch. So two doors that have access to that screened in porch. It's our closets. And again, all the flooring is carpet in here. This is our full bathroom. And again, that marble top, nice wood cabinets. And we have a tub shower combination in this bathroom as well. And another light, so plenty of light that comes in this home. And again, your tile flooring there. Heat and air unit is about 10 years old. Uh, we've got a hot water heater that's newer, it's about six years old. 
And again, this is another one of our additional bedrooms here. The bedrooms are all about uh, 12 by 11 or 11 by 11. Take you right back out. Home is in very good condition. It uh, really shows very well. I'm going to take you outside, out these sliders, and let's go outside. We have a really nice size yard. So we have this uh, really nice, long, screened-in porch with ceiling fan. We have an open patio. So if we go right here, you can see this open patio area and then just a view of the yard. So really nice yard. This is an all brick home. And again, you can see those gutters all the way around in this open patio area. Now that yard is belongs to somebody else. There is not a fence down between these two property lines, but this tree that you see is on the property lines and it goes all the way back to the back. So let's go back inside. So once we're back in the home, just one more time to recap, we're at 2002 Hamilton Crossing in Cantonment, Florida. Zip code here is 32533. Home is listed at $186,900. Three bedroom, two full bathrooms, 1953 square foot, and it was built in 1996. Thanks so much and have a great day.